Hi movie fans, the 23rd of September 2017 is the 39th birthday of actor Anthony Mackie. Despite being 15 years into his film career, Mackie as an actor still feels fresh and full of potential. His feature film debut came in 2002's 8 Mile and Mackie has since become a part of one of the biggest movie franchises of all time with the MCU. But outside of that, Mackie has built a filmography to be proud of. I haven't seen his most recent release, Detroit, yet, so it won't appear on this list. Here are the Firewall's top 10 Anthony Mackie movies. At number 10 is The Adjustment Bureau. When David Norris strays from the path which had been chosen and set out for him, he is met with strong opposition from manipulating forces, including Harry Mitchell, played by Mackie, whose miscue is to blame for Norris making choices on his own instead of sticking to the plan. The running time is 106 minutes, and the Adjustment Bureau has the firewall rating of 7.3 out of 10. At number 9 is Half Nelson. Dan Dunn is a laid-back maverick of a high school teacher who wants to inspire and capture the imagination of his students, but with his personal life beginning to fall apart, Dunn's private issues spill over into his work. Mackie plays Frank, a local drug dealer. The running time is 106 minutes, and Half Nelson has the firewall rating of 7.3. At number 8 is the inevitable defeat of Mr. and Pete. The 13-year-old Mr. and 9-year-old Pete are two boys living in inner city New York when their mother is arrested, leaving the two kids to flee from child services and survive on their own. Mackie plays Chris, a powerful figure on the streets where the boys live. The running time is 108 minutes, and the inevitable defeat of Mr. and Pete has the firewall rating of 7.4. At number 7 is All the Way. Following the assassination of President Kennedy on the 22nd of November 1963, Vice President Lyndon Johnson must replace him in office. He then focuses on passing the Civil Rights Act. Mackie plays Martin Luther King Jr. who puts pressure on President Johnson. The running time is 132 minutes, and all the way has the firewall rating of 7.4. At number 6 is The Hurt Locker. In this war thriller, Staff Sergeant William Jones is a former US Army Ranger who is brought in as the new team leader of the Army Bomb Disposal Unit in Iraq, but whose actions raise some eyebrows among his squad mates. Mackie plays Sergeant J.T. Sanborn. The running time is 131 minutes, and The Hurt Locker has the firewall rating of 7.5. At number 5 is Ant-Man. As a scientific breakthrough is about to occur, which threatens to put the world in danger, Scott Lang is recruited by Dr. Hank Pym to become Ant-Man and put his cat burglary skills to good use. Mackie makes a cameo appearance as Sam Wilson, aka Falcon. The running time is 117 minutes, and Ant-Man has the firewall rating of 7.9. At number 4 is Avengers Age of Ultron. After discovering a new power source, Tony Stark and Bruce Banner decide that it could hold the key to completing their Ultron project which was designed as a way to keep Earth safe without the Avengers. But it all goes wrong and the team face a powerful foe. The running time is 141 minutes and Avengers Age of Ultron has the firewall rating of 8.1. At number 3 is Million Dollar Baby. This boxing drama sees waitress Maggie Fitzgerald, who believes she has what it takes to become a boxing champion, attempt to enlist the help and expertise of experienced trainer Frankie Dunn. Maggie plays a boxer who frequently trains at Dunn's gym. The running time is 132 minutes, and Million Dollar Baby has the firewall rating of 8.4. At number 2 is Captain America Civil War. Following a mission which resulted in the loss of civilian lives, the Avengers are told that they must work within certain guidelines. The proposition splits the team in two, with Captain America and Tony Stark having opposing views on the subject. The running time is 157 minutes, and Captain America Civil War has the firewall rating of 8.4. At number 1 is Captain America The Winter Soldier. Following the Battle of New York, Steve Rogers is starting to get a handle on life in the 21st century 
when a dangerous assassin interrupts Cap's settling in process. This film introduced Mackie into the MCU as former pararescueman Sam Wilson who befriends Rogers. The running time is 136 minutes and Captain America The Winter Soldier has the final rating of 8.5. Thanks for watching, next week I'll be counting down the files top 10 Marion Cotillard movies, don't forget to subscribe for more top 10s and reviews.